The Canadian Clock Museum is located in Deep River, Ontario, and it opened in May of 2000. There are over 400 clocks on display, with over 2,000 in the entire collection. The museum showcases the heritage of Canada's many clockmakers and sellers from the early 1800s to the present time. In the front entrance of the museum, there are starburst and sunburst decorator wall clocks which were manufactured in the 60s and 70s by House of Snyder and West Clocks Canada. On display are American clocks sold by Canadian sellers, which date back to the 1830s to 1860s. Wooden gears were used before 1840s until sheet brass began production in Connecticut. Sheet brass led to more affordable clocks because clock parts could be mass produced. This new material was also more accurate and durable than wooden parts. The first factory built Canadian clocks existed from 1872 to 1884. Early clocks had OG style cases and came standard with 30 hour weight driven movements. Later models came in many styles and were spring driven with 8 day movements. Nova Scotia and New Brunswick clocks were sold from 1820s to 1910. Up until 1840s these clocks had wooden geared 30 hour movements. Gingerbread style clocks were also popular from 1870s to 1920s and these were typically 8 day movements and spring driven. The Western Clock Company was located in Peterborough and operated from 1920 to 1986. The company created hundreds of models of alarm clocks including the well-known Big Ben and Baby Ben. Other main products included various wall clocks. West Clocks also produced three animated models, as well as various pocket watches and wristwatches. The Arthur Peganaw Clock Company was located in Berlin, Ontario, and then later Kitchener after 1916, when the city name was changed. The company produced 65 models of mantel clocks, 20 models of wall clocks, and 8 models of grandfather clocks. The museum collection includes most of the catalogued models, which shows the wide variety of styles over four decades. The Snyder Clock Corporation and then the later Snyder Clock Manufacturing Company operated in Toronto, Ontario from 1950 to 1976, and they designed and produced more than 200 models of wall and mantel clocks. On display are some models that represent the Black Forest Clock Company, Forestville Clocks, New Haven Clock Company, Canadian General Electric, the Ingram Canadian Clock Company, and Seth Thomas Clocks. Electric advertisement clocks were very popular in shops in Canada during the 8th to late 20th century. Clock examples on display show the most common categories represented, including dairy products, soft drinks, beer, and service station products. Other unique exhibits include a punch card clock made in London, England, a buffet clock made by the Arthur Peganaw Clock Company, a watchmaker's roll top bench with a foot operated lathe.
and various items from the early 20th century, including phonographs and Singer sewing machines. Thanks for viewing our brief video of the Canadian Clock Museum. For more information about the history of clocks in Canada or our exhibits, you can visit our website at canclockmuseum.ca.